Abba, Father, I praise and worship you. God of the universe, I reverence you. You do great and mighty things, my Lord. Be thou exalted, the King of Synagogue Church of all nations, for the gift of Mama Evelyn Joshua and her helpers, who has taken the mantle of Synagogue Church of all nations, setting captives free. Hallelujah. God has said that the troubles and trials, limitations, career failures, diseases, and all whatnot that we see today, that we are going to see them no more. I believe it. And that settles it for me. It settles it for me. I don't know about you. If you believe, say amen. And so it shall be. This is a true saying. There is fullness of redemption in Jesus Christ. Get Jesus in your life and you have everything. No wonder the Bible said, Seek ye the kingdom of God first and his righteousness. And every other thing shall be added unto you. Seek Jesus. Find Jesus. Hunger for Jesus Christ. In him there is fullness of redemption. In Jesus there is no lack. In Jesus there is no oh, worries. In Jesus you have liberty. Seek you the kingdom of God. Seek you Jesus Christ. He's the Savior. He's the uh, uh, Redeemer. He's the Healer. He's, everything is in Him. There is fullness of joy in Him. Whatever you need is in Jesus Christ. Then secondly, when we pray the will of God in our lives, God answers very fast. Yeah, one may ask, how how can I pray the will of God? My dear, the will of God is that you live in good health. The will of God is that you prosper. The will of God is that you live in joy, peace, harmony, and so forth and so on. That is the will of God. So when you pray, in that direction God answers if you're sick call him Jehovah Rapha he will come quickly and heal you if you have faith that God can heal you he will heal you remember the Bible said if your faith is not enduring you will not endure we need to have faith in our dealings with God He's a spirit. We don't see him. We are just having faith. We believe even without seeing. We believe. And that what makes us children of God. It's our faith in him that settles every issue. Believe in God. Believe that he exists. Believe he can do all things. Ah, It's only then that you have strong faith. Mama Evelyn Joshua of Synagogue Church of All Nations. God has started to use you to deliver souls. Yes. Finances are being set free. Destinies are being set free. Marriages are being set free. Careers are being set free. You rightly put it, Ma, that uh, we should have faith and not fear. Truly, fear is the weapon the devil uses to destabilize um, children of God. But should we, ought, should we fear? We ought not fear because we have an almighty father. When I say almighty, good people comes out of my body. 
because you cannot imagine how great this man is. You can just imagine somebody who inhabits seven and eight is the food stool. Ah, how great and mighty he should be. He told us that he doesn't live in houses made with hand. What kind of house will you build for him that will uh, accommodate him? No. So, children of God should not have fear, just as a woman of God said. We should not fear. We should not allow the devil to destabilize us with fear. Please, please, my listeners, believe in your mighty Father in heaven. Who said you should not fear? That's his word. That he will always be with you. Fear not, I will be with you. You can get such a that's a sentence up to several up to let me say 20 times in the Bible, if not more. Fear not, I will be with you. Fear not, I am with you. Our God is not a liar, He doesn't lie. If He will not do it, He cannot say it. Fear makes one to die seven times before his actual death. You see, did God not say that He will give us He will He will give up nations to set us free? He said it. I will tell you how important we are to our God. Everything concerning us is so dear, so important to Him. So why should we fear? Why should we fear? Fear shouldn't come uh, be in our agenda fear should not at all at all when you know if you need uh, or if you are sick your father is the only one who can heal if you know you need money you have a heavenly father who gives the idea to make the power to make money why then should you fear you shouldn't fear the only thing is, if you know that thing that brings separation between you and your father, that thing that will stand as a hindrance for you to get what you need from your father, desist from it. I say, desist from it. It's no other thing but sin. Ask God for the grace to overcome sin. And he will give you the grace. Sin is the only barricade we have in our relationship with God. My soul fear not, thy leader knows the way. My soul fear not, thy leader knows the way. My soul fear not, thy leader knows the way. My soul fear not, thy leader knows the way. My soul fear not, Dali da noet the way, my Sophia not. Dali da knows the way, Dali da knows the way, Dali da knows the way.